Hi everyone, welcome to Last Minute Coders. My name is Vinay. In this video, we are going to learn how we can give shadow to a button in a Canvas app, Power App. Before starting this video, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, like this video as well if you like the content. And if you have any query related to Power App, contact me at this mail ID. Okay, so let's start this video. So let me first insert a button and just show you how, how a button look like, okay. So I know you know what how the button look like. Okay, so this is a button. Okay, so these are some of the basic property like uh, if I wanted to change the text. So see this text. I can like if I wanted to change the text, I can change it to let's say submit. Okay, so in this way I can change uh, its text. Uh, we have like three display mode edit edit means it will be clickable. See view it will be just like uh, edit but it will not be clickable like the styling is just like edit but not be clickable and disabled the styling will change okay see now it is totally disabled and it just behave as view mode only so let's head back to edit now you can change the font size you can give the border you can give the border radius let me give border zero here okay uh sorry border radius is zero border radius means see if i give zero see up here the corners are like sharp now it is just like a rectangle but it is preferable like if you have a button either go for like 100 like round borders see this these are round borders or you can keep it as, as like 10 or 20 up to you see if i do like 10 so it will have a little bit corners see this curve at the corners okay so for now let's keep it as 100 let's create a button like this okay so this is done to increase the size of this text uh, we have this font size so let us change it to maybe 24 okay so this is done and uh, uh, rest are rest are pretty much simple i know you know you guys know like you can change the color from here okay rest all we you can do i know but uh, I haven't found any shadow property for this button. Okay, for this button control, we do not have any like shadow property. So how we will give the shadow then? For that, what you need to do, go to insert, uh, go to layout and inside layout, you have this container, right? See this, click on this container. Okay, once you click on this container, see container have this drop shadow property. So see if I click on bold, select bold sorry and if i play the app so see here now it contains shadow this container contains shadow so what we need to do the trick is very simple just place this button inside this container okay and style this style this container in a way that it will let's say it will cover the whole area of this button okay see i place the button inside this container now what I need to do is I need to align this button from its uh, horizontal and vertical axis from zero zero. Okay, see, this is done. Uh, let me give its height as maybe seventy because that is seventy is fine. Uh, width is uh, anyways okay. Let me change its font size to twenty. Okay, so it looks okay. Now I clicked on this container. What I need to do is. For its width, I need to say button. I think the name of the button is 8, button 8 dot width. And for its height, I'll say button 8 dot height. Okay. This is done. Okay. So, this is cool. If I play the app, but do you see this, like there is little bit corners up here. See this white corner, so how we can get rid of them. So, I click up here. Whatever your button, see, this is a button, right? Button has border radius 100. So container should also have border radius is 100. So I clicked up here. Let us change it to 100. And better, better, you have to write 100 up here. Okay. So once you write 100 up here, reason because once I clicked up here, see border radius, see the name of the property, radius top left. And we have like four, like this radius top left, radius top right, radius bottom right. Okay. So if you write 100 up here now, automatically everything will be 100. See this. 
so just keep a note of it okay for you it might um, behave weird otherwise if if let's say if this is thousand so see a styling change right so make sure that all are hundred okay now if this time if i play the app see uh that ugly borders are now removed and i see the shadow up here so this is it for this video i hope you enjoyed it and if you did don't forget to like this video one more thing before ending this video let me first delete this container if you want to support my work financially uh, here is my qr code you can pay any amount if you want to support me otherwise the best way to support me is by subscribing to this channel i'll see you in the next one till then take care goodbye bye bye